Hey everyone, Alex here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to enable Secure Boot on your PC. So the first thing we're gonna to wanna to do is check the state of Secure Boot. Easiest way to do that is to go down to your Windows menu at the bottom left and type in System Information. Go ahead and click on that, and then around the middle of your page, you'll see Secure Boot State. And here we can see that it is indeed off, so let's get that on. Now we're gonna go down to the left Start menu here. We're gonna click on Settings. Navigate to Windows Update on the left here. Click on Advanced Options. Then go to Recovery at the bottom here. And what we want is this Advanced Startup section. This is going to allow us to restart our device into the BIOS or UEFI mode. So I'm going to go ahead and click Restart Now and then switch my recording. All right. So now we're going to go click on Troubleshoot at the bottom here. Click on Advanced Options. And then this is what we want, the UEFI firmware settings. So this is going to take us into the BIOS. So go ahead and click on that and restart your PC. All right, so now this has put us in our PC's BIOS page. Yours will probably look a little bit different, but don't worry about that. All you need to look for is either the boot or security page. And I don't see that immediately on mine, so I'm going to go ahead and click on advanced mode at the bottom here. And then I immediately at the top see um, this bar and boot looks like a promising option for me. So I'll click on that. And the one thing you want to note is that you need to make sure CSM is off to have secure boot enabled. So make sure that that's disabled, like you can see here. And then go back, click on Secure Boot, and this particular BIOS is really poorly named. Um, if OS type is Other OS, that means Secure Boot is off. But if it's on the other option, the Windows UEFI mode, then Secure Boot is on. So uh, confusing naming, but you know, keep an eye out for that. Here's an example of where you can find it under a Dell BIOS, under Boot Configuration, and on an MSI BIOS under Settings. So just take a look around. I'm sure you'll find it in your BIOS. So back to mine, um, if I go to Windows UEFI mode on here, that should turn things on. Now I can go to exit, uh, make sure my changes have been saved. Here I can see exactly what I was changing and go ahead and restart my PC. So now my computer has reset and we're gonna confirm that Secure Boot is on by once again going to System Information, clicking on that, scrolling down to Secure Boot State and we can see it's now properly on. Thanks for watching and see you next time.